Hi everyone, I'm uh, Kyle Isthko. I am an industry microbiologist at Microbial Discovery Group and a proud ASM member. And today I find myself in a position to share with you guys some insight on topics that we don't normally talk about in the open. That's your value, right? Whether that's trying to identify new career changes, whether that's trying to identify uh, new salary negotiations, um, we're finding it harder and harder to gather the data that we need to make more informed decisions for ourselves. So this presentation is about how we hope we can change a little bit of that, the tools ASM is developing and deploying to make you guys more informed, um, and also giving you guys a little bit more insight into what your peers are making and how you can leverage that data on your behalf for your own career. So let's start with the problem. It's estimated right now that one out of every three microbiologists do not know if they're being paid competitively. Think about that for a second. Are we being paid fairly? That's a huge question, it's a huge problem. The lack of clarity doesn't necessarily just affect the paycheck that you're making today. It also has huge implications in your career trajectory, your job satisfaction, um, and your ability to advocate for yourself. An inability to advocate for yourself can cost you earlier in your career. Um, it's actually estimated right now that people that come to these early negotiations unprepared to negotiate are losing about five to 7% of total annual salary that they'd be able to make up otherwise. And what's even crazier when you think about that number is that for every $1,000 that you leave on the table when it comes to your total annual salary, that could be upwards of $500,000, half a million dollars that you lose over the course of your career. We deserve better, our profession deserves better, um, and I think we finally have a way to do something about that. So here's the opportunity. Studies show that job seekers who use this accurate data can generally make between five and 7% more in their initial job salary surveys. Um, it doesn't necessarily just affect your current job, it compounds over time, it impacts your future raises, but this accurate role and region specific data that ASM is currently collecting on your behalf um, is trying to make this a more informed decision. It's trying to give you a more informed insight, not necessarily about just what you're going to need to do today to land that job, but how you're going to maintain that momentum over the course of your career. Imagine going into your next negotiation prepared with hard data at your side so that it's not just, I feel like you're worth this, but it's like, no, this is where I stand and this is why I, I deserve this salary to start with. So that's where ASM's new salary survey comes in. Um, when you take just a few minutes, what you get out is a free personalized salary survey um, tailored to your role, your location, and where you are at right now in your career. So this isn't just a generic number, it's your data informed by your peers and it's curated specifically for where you are in your career. So whether you're job hunting, hiring, um, or just trying to plan your next career move, this report gives you clarity and hopefully a little bit more confidence. So we've already seen this actually play out beneficially for a few of our members um, that have leveraged this information. We've seen members try to ask themselves, uh, you know, should I take that next assistant professorship in Texas when I currently live in California? This gives you an idea geographically over space what that salary compensation plan could look like for professors that are also in Texas. Um, others have actually used it to make the determination whether or not they want to pitch themselves into industry, whether they want to change into government. Um, and so that's another valuable additive that this opportunity provides. It's information not just for academics, we're really trying to reach a global network of microbiologists in different sectors so that regardless of where you are in your career, you now have a more informed opportunity to make that decision for yourself with real data that other industries outside of academia are also allocating for. Um, for early career professionals too, it shows how much your earning potential could be swayed by pursuing the doctorate, by pursuing a master's degree, by doing or not doing a postdoc. So all of these pieces of information um, you can include as a part of the salary survey, and that output that you get is actually tailored with this type of information at your disposal. Here's the ask. What we need, um, if you believe in fair pay, career transparency, but you're also there to help the next generation be more informed about the field of microbiology, please, 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 Take the survey, I will get out of the way. Um, it only takes a few minutes, uh, and in return, like I said, you get this personalized report, it can help shape your future, um, but also it's really helpful for the next generation of microbiologists. So the more responses that we get means the more data uh, we generate, the more comprehensive and believable the data becomes, um, the more informed we all become are because of it. So do it for yourself, and then if you get the chance, share it with your lab mates, your work colleagues, uh, the next lab meeting that you have for your labs, feel free to share it as a, as a plug. Um, the more data we get, the better. 
So our goal at the end of this is to create a more transparent, equitable, and overall empowered workforce, um, both for today and for tomorrow. If you haven't yet, please take the survey and pass it around to those that you can. Um, I think we'll all be a lot better for it, both now and in the future. So thanks.